Welcome to Webstyle Press. You know, React 19 has changed a lot. So if we need a quick boilerplate for React 19, it needs a different approach now. Look at this setup. React JS 18 being used over CDN in HTML page. React and version is latest. React to NPM, latest version right now is 18. And here it is using unpkg and umd. UMD was used to load React without a build step. Starting with React 19, React no longer produces UMD builds to reduce the complexity of its testing and release process. Changing React version to 19 and this setup won't work now. With React 19, it's recommended to use ESM-based CDN such as ESM.SH. This is ESM.SH, fast, smart, global ESM CDN. Create modern web apps easily with NPM packages in browser. No build tools needed. Import this thing from ESM.SH slash package and then version. Import module from package version path. So for this old setup, this was the result. And now here is how we will implement Drake 19 using new process. First of all, inside body tag, let's take a div with ID root inside head section, script with type module. Import React and use state from ESM.sh React version slash question sign dev. Similarly, React DOM. Question sign dev instructs the CDN to serve a development version of the library. Development versions include additional warnings, more descriptive error messages, and are not minified. This makes debugging easier, but may affect performance due to larger file sizes and additional logging. After that, on window load, define const counter, declare state, count, set count, initial state is zero. Return react.create element, create div element, empty function, then create h1 heading and then buttons. No function on heading, but display count value from state. For buttons, create button element, apply on click event handler, apply on click event handler functions, and display text inside buttons, increment, decrement. Let's create these functions. Here are increment and decrement functions. Set count count plus one. For decrement, set count count minus one. Finally, use the React DOM client to render counter in the DOM, targeting div ID called root, and here is the output. We would not use unpkg, umd, and babel here. Instead, esm.sh was used. So if you have questions or want more details, let me know in comments. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.